Yo, what is up? This is Aragotic here. So we got to account level 65. So I just wanted to do a little bit of a progress update. I mean, there's not like a crazy amount to go with, which is kind of why there's, the updates are slow and why I don't really upload as much. I can't really, as I've said before, just update, hey, this event's going on. I just finished this event. Um, I'm probably going to start updating during events, though. I know that's kind of you know, ironic or whatever to kind of say I'm going to update events, but, uh, you know, it, it can be short videos showing what events are going on at the moment though. It, I'm not going to do events that are just like gear enhancement and stuff, which by the way, we did get through it already. Um, I've been trying to do events as much as possible, but one thing I know is that next gear enhancement, that's 5k. I probably can't get, um, huge bottleneck at the moment for this account especially is the gear enhancement like uh i can get gear with oh yeah 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 so quickly well it's still on my mind arcane dominator so we are doing stage 11 which i know everybody's basically past this by now but we this is our team at the moment um, I feel like this is the fastest one. I've tried multiple different teams and it's just not quite working in other ways. So for example, like Miriam, she just doesn't do quite enough. Um, Nathalia, she dies. Uh, Horton, I don't feel like he's going to, or Hacker and whatever. I don't think he's going to do enough. Um, Zalux, he also dies. Maybe I need to redo his kit. <laughs> I'm not quite sure like the balance between attack and defenses and stuff like that. I still got to mess around with it. Uh, Santos, like I guess we could try that over Avera again, but I feel like Avera helps me get through the earlier waves enough that it kind of cancels out, makes it good. CR would be a good one because of the increased damage, but I don't really know if the increased damage affects poison, which again, Galo and Valak really help with. Radira, we can't get rid of Radira. It's just, she's too important for the team. However, one thing to note is that we have gotten quite a few heroes. Um, just from daily logins and summons and stuff like that, I've definitely gotten pretty lucky. So, I mean, we still have our basics, but then we have gotten William, which is nice. Uh, we got Windstrex, we got Brand, which is huge for this account. Uh, I'm not sure if Warden was on it last update, but we got also Scarlet. We've got Lightweight and Zachary, which I'm going to try building him for Arena. I'm not quite sure if that's where he should go or not, but we're going to go with that. You know, just to mess around with it a little bit and test things out. Otherwise, we're kind of at the same place, right, with our account. Um, we got to work on God Fairy still. I did want to build up God Fairy, but then we got other characters. So something I know that I'm stubborn about is that I don't want to swap or play musical chairs with gear. Uh, so I've been going, which is probably why my account is going so slow. I'm building up characters one at a time and it's not the worst thing in the world. Like I've taken some gear off of others that are, you know, needing a little bit of love. Hydrosia, I'll be real with you. Even with some of the best gear, I just, I'm not impressed by her. Like the best gear from that I have on my account, I should say right now she's got low uh, health and whatnot. Like I probably can give her a little bit of love. However, one thing is we've been definitely getting the abilities up, but then also glyphs. So while we're working on the gear, I have completely gone through the glyphs and made sure that anybody that I'm going to potentially work with is already fully glyphed out, which <laughs> it might be a little uh, not the greatest idea because it's a lot of time investment, a lot of stamina, um, but we have gotten a lot of them that we're not even playing yet, like Brand. Uh, Windstrex needs still some attention. William, we're plant, we're kind of half using. Borden, we got up, even though <laughs> I don't know when we're going to start really using him. Same with Scarlet, Leetwing, Zachary. Kane, we already had up. Uh, Myla was like the earlier stages, but then we didn't end up going through. Godfrey, we've been working on the purple side. So, 
I have been putting a lot of resources into characters that I haven't been using and I don't plan on using for a bit because I just want the glyphs out of the way. Same with like the abilities. I just want that all out of the way so that I could just say, hey, I'm going to try this character out. Let's just throw some gear on him. Which, I mean, isn't the worst thing in the world, but I really don't plan on using some of these characters until way down the line. I need to, I really need to solidify a team that's for uh, Queen of Tides and Arena. Right now, our Arena team is kind of stolen from other people in the sense of, uh, let's see if I see someone. Um... Pretty common. Okay, of course not that it's yeah. Okay, of course it's not there at the moment. But um Windstrex. I'm kind of for example, like this is my team at the moment. So Windstrex, the idea is that I make everybody go by go up really quickly so that I beat them in speed, uh, unless their team also has a Windstrex. Um <clears throat> this has been working pretty well. I follow Windstrex with Nathalia or Ivera. Uh, I think it's Nathalia followed by Ciara and then Avera. So basically I've been keeping Ciara here because the passive where she does um, AoE damage to everybody once you get them down to below 50%. Nathalia seems to always get people below 50% like she's a, she's a monster with the damage. So it's kind of Nathalia and Ciara just together on turn 2. And then Avera is kind of just there doing the AOE afterwards that just kind of cleans up the house. Maybe Hydrissi would be smart here as well. Um, I was using Mirian, which I'm not quite sure if I'm building Mirian correctly, but it's been working for everywhere I put her in. She's I made her kind of a master uh, or a jack of all trades, master of none. So she's got the uh, revival set. It's, it's healing you, you know, that's that's good and all. Um, but then it's like super tanky. Like I've gone with tank more than damage because she life steals and I, she life steals base off of, um, attack. Right. But, uh, she has the, uh, 3% uh, targets max health. So right there, it's not like attack's going to help. Um, the extra damage here like that would help a lot. Um, but she doesn't seem to really need attack. Uh, she gets it here as well. I'm not quite sure if people build her more attack and crit rate or whatever, but it, we're just going to keep building her tank, which seems to be working pretty well. Wooden strikes, I don't know what I should be aiming for in speed. She's pretty decent, I would say, compared to my other characters. Um, Brand... Now, I know Brand is kind of a big deal on accounts. I'm not quite sure where he goes exactly, potentially Arena. Um, but he, we got him just recently, like within the last few days, and I, I just wasn't expecting it. So it's kind of hard to know where I should put him, if he needs crit rate, if he needs speed whatnot you know right now he's got the revival set as well and i've been just putting defense and health on him because his health is an s and his defense is a you know it works out um it, it's where you should be putting a lot of the focus on uh i feel like the taunt the decrease in the 50 percent defense like maybe we should just immediately make him go second like if we did Arena, for example, Windstrax followed by him, followed by Nathalia and Ciara. Maybe that would be good because then we could tank the next team if that doesn't kill them. Um, so another thing is we did leave the guild that I was in before. Uh, it kind of died out and I realized that I was kind of missing a lot of content by staying in the other guild. Uh, like nobody was doing anything in the sense of like pushing things and so... Like, for example, Battle or whatever. Like, Ruins of Gods. Nobody was doing this in the other one. Uh, this one has the light uh, on the boss. I'm not sure if light's a decision that is made from the guild itself or if it's just the rotation. But the other one, I don't remember ever seeing light or dark. Like, it just wasn't a thing that came up or at any point. And it was here the first day that I got to this guild. 
So I'm gonna just say that either lucky or, you know, it just is what it is. I kind of am chilling on some stuff. Um, challenge seems to be new, just kind of came out. Because, well, or, you know, it's it's been chilling there since yesterday or something. But arena, I think we can get the plat, honestly. I just need to remember to do the arena off cooldown, refresh, and just do level 50s and stuff like that. Make sure I can get them. I think we can get to gold one at least, right? So that's not something I'm too worried about. As for the shops, obviously we're still buying the top shop. Uh, we buy out the first six diamond shop. We buy out the meal coupons. I don't really know with the pumpkins if they're worth it or not. I don't think they are. Um, but nonetheless, my account's at a point where all the characters I want to have six star are already there. Like, it, right now it's not worth it, for sure. Guild of All, I don't really care about Yolanda, so I'm not putting, I'm not getting her yet. I'm not uh, investing in her for the guild tokens, and I'm not sure what to really spend the guild tokens on. Like, I mean, I could always get the advanced summoning crystals because those are fun, which I know these are probably not worth getting, but this was a really good ring. This didn't seem as good, but like it seems okay, but for 600, I'm not going to do two flat rolls. Uh, maybe these are worth getting, but I don't know. That's kind of a lot, you know, that this seems like a lot. Arena shop, 1100. We could do a little bit better here, honestly. Uh, I can't remember what we were really saving for. I guess we could just use it for the summoning crystals. I mean, Abaddon, I don't know if he's any good, but if he is, maybe we should look at him as well. Uh, trial shop, I'll be honest with you, I've been so lazy with trials. I kind of have forgotten like two or three weeks in a row to even do them. I just finished the one this week. Uh, I, I gotta stop being lazy with some of this stuff. It's just, it really is hard sometimes when the content kind of feels like it's plateaued. You know, it's just there's not a lot of new stuff coming in compared to the time investment that there is. So I just kind of I lose that motivation, which is really depressing. As for event shop, since I have missed a couple, uh, that's it is what it is. Orac is what I want. Like I could get the three summoning crystals, but right now he's already to ascension. And let me see. Do 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 alter. Here, sent this now. Promote. Oh, no, 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 no. It'd be in backpack. I'm stupid. Um, <clears throat> Matrix. Do I not have any of him? I thought I had 40, but nonetheless, okay. Well, I'm going to need to save up and get that because it's more important, I think, to get Orac than the summoning crystals. Speaking of summoning crystals, I haven't summoned in a hot minute, so let's do like, I don't know, 36 summons to bring us down to 60. Okay, we can't skip it. So, you know, we'll see what's in it. Okay, Urzag. Kind of not the greatest. Jacob, okay. I do want to work on Jacob at some point. You need Ascension in him, so that's a good pull. But yeah, right now, I feel like the account's in an okay spot to start progressing. Overall, I'm content. Harbag, we don't have him yet. So that's cool. New, ca new people are always going to be wanted. Always going to be happy about new characters, you know? We'll do this one six more summons after. Okay, another Jacob. That's I'm 100% okay with that. Okay, let's see. Yeah, Joseph, that's whatever. Valak, whatever. Raven, don't care. Mudos. Okay, we can't skip this one. This will probably be the last epic slash legendary. Because I only have one more summon after, but let's see. Virgil. Okay, I have no interest in building Virgil, at least right now. But yeah, 660, I think... I think we're okay now on that. 
Because we have another new character. Let's um go to Epic real quick. The Book of Runes preserves you. Where's Jacob? There we are. <laughs> but yeah, I think we're in a pretty decent spot. Like I'm not upset over where we're at. The one thing is though that I would love to see is having another summon event. A summon event would be great. Um I still don't know if we've even had another summon event since one time in the beginning. But it would be great. Um, I just... It's it's hard to... It's hard to want to summon when I know that it could happen. But yeah, that's the account. We're at an okay spot. We're just going to keep farming. Um, we're just going to keep farming for revival and curse sets. And then we're going to move over to um, Warrior Sets. Um, we've got to do Endless Trial as well. Uh, uh, Magister. I don't know why I said Warrior. The uh, Raider Sets is what I want to go for. But that's where we're at. I'm pretty happy. Next time I update, we'll probably be at 60... 66 or 67. And uh, hopefully I have more characters built out and I can say what I've actually decided on teams because I'm really getting to a point where I'm team building in the sense of trying to figure out what's best. So if you have any suggestions or recommendations on teams from what characters you see I have, then I'm all years because yeah. But anyways, this is my 65 update. I hope you have a wonderful day. Take care, guys.